Basically, kids like around town, yeah. you know what I mean? Like just like the gnarly rippers around town. Like there was this dude, his name was Eric Benthin. So that was basically the, like what inspired me in the beginning. Just Raven Terche, basically like Emmanuel Guzman, like uh, I just see a lot of, there's a lot of good skating right now. You know, like, I mean, Paul Rodriguez, like these dudes are so like on their stuff and like, it's, it's just, it's just insane. It's almost like a, like Kung Fu. Like I want to say like a kind of like Bruce Lee martial arts type of thing. And they've excelled to a level where they're just like, just masters, you know? And uh, it's, it's, it's like, it's, 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 it's just impressive. We'd take the bus up from uh, from Half Moon Bay and come, you know, skate Embarcadero. The wave, it had the wave and like, had, you know, like the Gons Gap and the Seven Stairs. And so like, you would like go there and think about like what you could do. And you, all these people were skating and it was like, it was like a skate park, but you, you felt, um, you know, it was like you felt comfortable there because it was it was like just a street environment. It was like you would still go to the local Carl's Jr. and get a soda and kick it and, you know, until you learn yeah. certain tricks and that. And I, I tried to surf one time and I had like this, uh, this big old wetsuit. It was like way too big for me. And the whole thing filled with water. And I fucking, I'm on this surfboard and I'm like trying to get out. These waves are super gnarly and like, I start sinking because the fucking, the, the, the wetsuit was full of water and I'm sinking. I'm like, dude, I'm gonna die right now. I'm like, so I'm holding onto the board to like make me not sink and I'm just fucking way too stressful. So I just had to let it go. To me, I, I feel like you need to give your energy to, to what's helping you out. So if, if Transworld came to me and they were like, we wanted, you know, asked me to do a, a, a video part. I thought to myself, like, yeah, I want to contribute to that because they've contributed to me to, to being able to, you know, live my life through skateboarding. So, of course, like, I, I, I want to do that, you know? So, and, and as far as making a video part, I was like, that's just your, your duty as a skateboarder, like, to, like, put it down, you know, and work hard and put in work to expose like what your type of skating is. I mean, you're selling skateboards. That's, that's how you're making your money. So you need to expose what you're doing. You know, something to look forward to basically. Like for me, seeing skate parks and just seeing different parts of the world and different things to skate just makes you want to like go check those spots out and go skate them. If without the the exposure and the things that we would put down, it wouldn't be seen and it wouldn't, there'd be no, it just would be nothing. <laughs> yeah. Mark Gonzalez, like just his way of looking at skateboarding and just approaching it was, is just like forever the gnarliest thing. Like it's the hardest, the, everything he does is the hardest and the most flowing. He's just a beast, dude. And so I just give it up to Mark straight up. Christian for just his just raw blasting airs, his smooth style, his happy-go-lucky attitude. He was always like, what's up? Like just love and like just ruling. Like his energy was awesome. I'll give it up to Sacramento skateboarders, you know, Rick Windsor straight up. Tony Hawk just just for like, just the insane, you know, 540s with no hands and like, just all the tricks he had, his ramps, all the ramps that he had. And I thought that, that was insane. Like, I, he's just like, Tony Hawk's the best, you know, so. Yeah, Gons though, I, I already said it. It's like, he, he you know, he, just everything, vert, street, like, whatever. Running, you know, like he was, 
a, a great jumper on feet, like pfft, just a human being. Like so, I, I'll give it up to Mark.